this is the BLK360. This is a 3D laser scanner. It takes pictures, it takes laser measurements, 360,000 laser measurements a second. What you get out of this is 360 degree pictures uh, minus the what's underneath it in a 20 degree, no, 30 degree arc either side of center. Uh, you'll get a completely 360 degree view in both pictures and in laser points. Now what it's going to do is scan the room and get a sense of how what the room is set up like, like what objects are near, what objects are far, and then I think it's going to go and do the cameras on the back side of this are going to rotate a little bit, take pictures, front, top, bottom. So right now, that camera's flash, that camera's taking a picture, that camera's taking a picture, and that camera's taking a picture. Yeah, so you can Okay, so that should be pretty close to done. Now, the little mirror in the center is rotating super fast and it is shooting out lasers um, so at, at any given point on that rotation it'll shoot out a laser strike an object come back register how long it took give it a distance and it uses polar coordinates using uh, the angle with by which it leaves and the angle by which it's rotating around the center to give each distance coordinate an XYZ value by translating it from polar coordinates to Cartesian. Uh, but as it's coming around here, we'll see how that translates into the camera. If you can even see it spinning, there you can just barely make out that it's spinning. There it is. So what we have here is my garage in a 3D point cloud. I took six scans of my garage, stitched them together, and this is the result. The BLK360 uh, uses that 360 degree photosphere to color each dot, each point in the cloud, so that way you get kind of a, a red, green, blue uh, cloud effect. So. Let's pretend that we're going in here, like this is how I get into my garage every day. I go through this door, and here we are. This is my shop. Welcome. It is extremely messy. <laughs> so each one of these is a photosphere. So we can hop right in and see what the camera saw at that moment. Zoom in, and we can go right back to 3D, like so. I mean, that's just cool, right? Look at that. So yeah, here's the uh, the new welder down in the corner there. Shout out to Gamble Garage for the uh, the welding helmet hooking me up. Appreciate it. And yeah, got the overhead. Got you can look at little details here and there. My car jack just lying on the floor. Random bat someone threw away because you know I can't not pick it up. Uh, random saws up on the wall. New sub panel. Yeah, so lots of data over here. We got the mill, got the lathe, uh, the DROs that we put in not too long ago. Woodworking hand tools, stuff like that. So anyway, we wanted to see how good it was. Let's do that. This appears to be just a hair short of three inches, 15 and 7 sixteenths, uh, from the bottom of this uh, to the floor. Looking at uh, hair over one and three quarters. Oh, 
let's call that 10 and a half inches on center. Eight and three eighths. Eight and three eighths. So in the future, as I'm designing uh, new pieces of uh, work equipment, whether that be a, a new shop bench or a shelf or what have you, I can take this scan and pull dimensions right off of it. Uh, and I'll be able to say, okay, it's from here to here, it's three foot eight and a half inches, which uh, then I know, oh yeah, okay. so. If I'm doing, if I'm elsewhere, or if I just don't want to go out with a tape measure, or uh, there's stuff in the way, you know, like for instance, if uh, sometimes you want to, you'll want maybe to measure something in the overhead, uh, but you can't, it's too far up. Uh, now I can go into the overhead and measure it. I mean, it's just really neat the way that works. So yeah, the program lets you do all kinds of crazy things use our limit box here and we can uh, take off the roof and let's take out the garage like that confirm and there we go hey thanks for watching hope you enjoyed this uh, slight detour and uh, tangent into 3d laser scanning from our usual uh, Tom foolery that we do here and uh, basic home repair blah 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 this is, you know really this is more of a vlog of what I happen to be doing on any given day than a, a serious project channel isn't it but anyway I hope you enjoyed stick around more interesting things to come <laughs>